in court as Joseph Weekly's defense attorney and prosecutors sifted through potential jurors outside the courthouse. About a dozen people protested, upset that it's taken three years for this controversial case to come to trial. The prosecutor has had ample time to bring this case, and we're waiting far too long for it. And that's why we're here, is to let everybody know that we're not going to stand for more militarization of the police. Detroit police officer Joseph Weekly is charged with involuntary manslaughter and careless discharge of a weapon causing injury or death. It was in May of 2010 when Detroit police threw a flashbang grenade into the house where Ayanna was sleeping with her family. Police were searching for murder suspects, but prosecutors are expected to argue that as soon as police busted through the door, Officer Weekly carelessly fired his weapon. One bullet struck and killed Ayanna. This has uh, little to do with police procedure um, and has everything to do with making uh, entertainment for reality television and it has everything to do with um, with a police department, a police system that thinks that it can get away with this kind of terrorism in black communities. One person expected to take the stand, Ayana's grandmother, who was sleeping on the couch with her when the deadly shot was fired. One thing we don't know right now is if Joseph Weekly himself will take the stand in his own defense. In downtown Detroit, Kimberly Craig, 7 Action News.